61A lecture number 30. Announcements. The scheme project is due next Thursday. Please get started. Please make progress over the weekend or early next week. To encourage you to make progress, you get an extra credit point by submitting part two before Monday at 11.59 p.m. In order to submit, you just run OK-Submit. Okay you can submit additional times after that once you finish part three and part four. That won't invalidate your submission from before. So please get started and finish all of part two, which is a huge number of questions by Monday, so that you have ample time to finish part three and even extra credit part four before the deadline. In order to make sure that you have enough support to complete the project, we'll hold office hours next week in renewed numbers more staff per office hour, and more office hours per day. So we're going to run from 10 to 8 instead of the normal 11 to 6 from Monday through Thursday. On Monday, I'll give an extra lecture on logical programming languages. That's in 6.30 p.m. in A1 Hearst Annex. There's software for this part of the course. The latest version of the scheme interpreter can be found here, and it was updated before lecture 29. So, if you're working on streams, you need to get this version, which will be distributed in lab this week as well. Starting today, we'll be talking about a programming language called SQL, or SQL. And for that, we'll use the implementation called SQLite, which you can use by downloading it to your own computer or using it online. But downloading it to your own computer is a much better idea, because then you can save files and so you won't lose your work. And that will cover us for the next four lectures. 